Well, good evening, everyone. I hope you're doing well. And this is your Royal Daily News for August 5th, 2022. In Oslo, the Norwegian royal court announced that His Majesty King Harald V of Norway has been diagnosed with an infection that must be treated with intravenous antibiotics and will therefore remain at the National Hospital for a few days. At this time, His Majesty's condition is stable. Meanwhile, Her Highness Princess Martha Louise of Norway, along with her daughter, Miss Maud Angelica Bean, visited His Majesty in the hospital. In Chiyoda, Tokyo, their Imperial Highnesses Crown Prince Akishino and Crown Princess Kiko of Japan visited the 80th All Japan Student Invention and Innovation Exhibition held at the Science Museum. In London, His Majesty King Abdullah II of Jordan met with the United Kingdom's Chief of Defense Staff, Admiral Sir Tony Radican. Discussions during the meeting focused on ways to bolster military cooperation between Jordan and the United Kingdom. In Germany, the magazine Bild released the official engagement photos of Ludwig, Prince of Bavaria, and his fiancée, Miss Sophie Alexandra Evekink. In the article, Ludwig's father, Prince Leutpold, noted that his son asked for Miss Evekink's hand in marriage in Berchtesgaden. He went on to say, quote, Ludwig made a good choice. My future daughter-in-law is a very intelligent and educated woman, end quote. Prince Lippold also said that he had hoped that Ludwig and Miss Evekink will start a family very soon. Moreover, that it was, quote, very gratifying that Ludwig is back in Bavaria again. For the past 10 years, he has worked as a development worker in Africa, so it's nice to have him back, end quote. And finally, on this day in royal history, in 1939, Her Royal Highness Princess Irene of the Netherlands was born at Sostek Palace in Bern. In 1968, Her Serene Highness Princess Karina of St. wittgenstein Berlberg was born in Northern California. And there you have it. Thank you all so much for watching. I really appreciate it. I will be back tomorrow on Saturday, August 6th with all the latest royal news. Until then, I wish you all a wonderful evening and a great day tomorrow. Okay, take care everyone. Bye-bye.